looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Madden Ultimate Coins, look no further than my sponsor, Mutt Reserve. Head over to MuttReserve.com. Use code Poodle at checkout for 30% off your order. Take advantage, guys. Do not waste your money on packs. Skip the packs. Head on over. Pick up some coins. Enjoy. Hello, right, everybody. It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we're going to be going over the new Pro Bowl LTD, the two Thursday LTDs, and some playoff hero reveals, which I will be getting into towards the end of the video. Of course, those are the screenshots. I'll get to that. But, guys, some exciting stuff. You know, the Playboy promo stuff has been pretty cool. Play Bro. Pro Bowl stuff has been pretty cool. I'm excited. It's exciting to see Pro Bowl content back, guys. If you guys have been following Madden long enough, you know that they really laid off of Pro Bowl content for quite a while. And there used to be some really fun stuff. Like, I always like to reference Madden 13. I remember we got a... It was a Pro Bowl uh, Calvin Johnson, like, three-star wide receiver. It was a crazy good card. It was exciting stuff back then, right? I like to see that. Again, I'm hoping we do pass 100 stats still. But for the meantime, Pro Bowl content does cut it. 97 over LTDs. Now, again... In-game messaging, as you probably see right above my head, still shows Fletcher Cox, which means the new one may not, may or may not be in packs. So I'm going to open up some packs regardless. Just going to check to see. The LTD should be live already. It's already past 1030. I really hate that they do that. A lot of people definitely lose out on coins and opportunity, always just spending money at this time, not knowing it's, like knowing it's not out. So they really need to just have make sure it is out by 1030 at all times. I mean, I know it is what it is, but, you know, it, it, would, just, it would be beneficial for everyone. So I did not see the new one. It's Deshaun Watson, if you guys didn't know. We had a 97 overall LTD Watson that can be powered up to a 98. So that is not up yet. Let's go check the LTDs because today we also have those as well, which are super fire cards as well. Okay, so let's see. Sort by newest. And we do have none of the new ones added. Let's go get, let's get into some packs first. Open up a few packs. And if we don't pull them, oh, let's, let's, get, let's cut to the chase. We won't pull them. When we don't pull them, although comment down, good luck. Maybe we can. When, when we, if we pull them, you'll know what they are. Now, guys, before we get into the rest of the video, make sure you're down below. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the noti bell, come join the family, give this video a big thumbs up as always. And if you guys need coins, pick up any of these cards, head over to my reserve down below and use code Poodle for an additional discount at checkout. Okay, so what pack should we open? Offensive or defensive pack? What are these? 184 plus chosen from the side of the ball. Ooh. Hmm, that's interesting. 80, 92 plus is 10%. What's it over here? 92 plus is 7.1. I might want to try one of these packs, but now... Offensive or 80, 184 plus from chose from your chosen side of the ball. So we have Deshaun Watson. We have let's see, let's see. We have ooh, okay. So let's let's open one of these. I want to try this. This pack sounds interesting. Let's see what we can get out of this pack right here. So we're gonna go with offense here. On yeah, offense, right? Deshaun Watson should be in packs right now. Alright, so we get 84 plus overall player pack. We got Joe Burrow. We get a low elite right here, 80 liner four nets. So that's not the one yet. We get a gold right here, hit it from the back. All right, so there's the final card. Oh, that's messed up. 65k for that. All right, let's, let's go to clutch packs. Let's go to clutch packs. Is that that was that was whack. All right. Let's see what we can get. Okay. Ooh, we got a decent animation right here. We get a 89 Derek Carr, a gold card. We get a Thanksgiving player. This is a long time ago. Jesse Davis. Oh lord. Oh lord. Okay, we're going to open up one more real quick and see if we can hit anything, guys. Still, no LTDs in the entire year. Very depressing. We have to hit one eventually, right? I mean, it, it's bound to happen. I just don't know when. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. That's it for the packs. Wasting a lot of our coins. We have some. So we have a lot of stuff to sell still, which we have on the block right now actually sitting there. So that'll come through. Let's check the auction block. Let's see if any of this stuff is up by now. Again, maybe there'll be some make rights. That's always cool too when you open. I mean, I guess that's the one benefit that maybe make rights. But EA has become very clear about the fact that if there's no in-game messaging, don't open packs. But you know, if you don't watch the EA stream or you don't do any of that stuff, you may not even know about that. So I don't know. I always kind of find it messed up that we go based on everything based off EA stream or Twitter when more than like probably 70% of the community maybe doesn't even use that. Some guys are just kids who come home from school, hop on Madden, waste some money. Oh, didn't get it. And they don't even think about it, right? Which kind of sucks in my opinion. I checked the LTDs. If not, I'll show you guys some screenshots because you know this stuff could take forever. Oh, uh, yeah, so nothing's up yet. All right, let's head over to the screenshot, show you guys the end of the playoff. Right, guys, so for the first card here, we do have 97 overall Deshaun Watson Pro Bowl LTD 2021. Now, guys, if you've been following any of the NFL news today, you would have known that uh, Deshaun Watson has officially asked for a trade request. Now, yes, he unofficially did mention that he wanted one, but this isn't official. Like, he put the papers in like he wants his trade request. He announced it, whatever it is. But will they fulfill it? Not sure, but usually when it gets this official, more or less, you will be gone now. Where can Deshaun Watson head to? I'm a Giants fan, guys. I would love to see Deshaun Watson in Giants blue. I don't know how he gets there. We have some picks. We have a decent pick in this upcoming draft. Nothing too crazy, but we can give a lot of picks. Give them back Daniel Jones if they want. I don't really know. I mean, maybe, I think the Dolphins could probably build a better package as well as the Jets. 
and the Jaguars. But hopefully the Jaguars will want to rock with Lawrence and we can get Laura, you know, Watson. But whatever it is what it is, he may be coming to New York nonetheless. Which again, I'm not a Jets fan, but I'll still like to see him in New York. But moving on, let's get into the stats. 90 speed, 97 throw power, 95 throw short, 94 medium accuracy, 92 deep accuracy, 94 throw under pressure, 96 throw on the run, and 92 play action. Now, this card's insane. This card is insane. Now, we need to see what his uh, archetype's going to be. Obviously, I can just go check prior to Sean Watson cards, which I'm going to go do right now real quick. Now, Deshaun Watson, I believe, is an improviser, which... Heck, it does hurt him. It, it does hurt him, guys. He doesn't get the best abilities and everything, but he's still a good card nonetheless. If you're not, you know... If you're, not, if you're not ability central and you just care more about a card and the player, Watson's a beast. He's going to have all the throwing thresholds. He's going to be fast. Yeah, he's an improviser. Super fast. Gets every... He's, he's literally the best probably throwing and running combo in the game. If we're not talking threshold, we're talking in general. But the archetype's going to hurt him. But that's enough for Deshaun Watson, guys. Super, super good card. Go try to pull him. Will you? Eh. It's going to be hard. He's rare. Still says it's not in game, so I wouldn't try just yet. Next, we have Terry McLaurin. Scary Terry's going to be one of our LTDs for today. Probably the best wide receiver in the game. 97 speed. 92, 97 speed powered up. Chemmed up, right? He will have all the route running thresholds, all the catching thresholds, and some of his routes and catching can get to 99 with the right chemistry, as well as 97 speed, which you cannot, you can't argue 97 speed, right? 97 speed. He's going to be meta. Like, he's going to be the best wide receiver in the game, hands down. Um, 97 speed, you know, just it's hard to match. It's hard to match. And honestly, guys... In terms of just 97 speed, like, that's since, like, like I said with Stefan Diggs and all them, they're all good, right? Now, this guy gets 97, you know, he's going to be at another tier than most of the other wide receivers in the game, and he gets all that route running as well, so he's going to be good. He's going to be good, guys. If you can get your hand in Terry McLaurin, he's going to be expensive. No power pass for him just yet. He's going to be hard to get. Probably won't be easy to obtain because he's an LTD as well. Some of you may not see him until he's a Redux card in your team, but nonetheless, if you can get him, you can pull him, rock with him. Honestly, I don't know. You could sell him for a lot of coins, but... He may just be game breaking right now. Next, guys, we have Justin Reed, which is our other LTD free safety for the Texans. Another fire looking card. 95 speed, 94 excel, and 87 tackle, 94 play rack, 95 pursuit, 82 man, and 96 zone, 88 hip power. Powered him come to pull up 96 speed at safety. Again, maybe the best free safety in the game. He'll have 96 speed, 95 excel, 88 tackle. He will get to 99 play rack, 96 pursuit. He will get to 98 man coverage, 99 zone coverage. He'll have 99 zone. 96 speed, 99 play rec, 89 hit power. Is he the best for safety? He's definitely up there for one of the best safeties. I don't know if he's overall the best, but guys, he's good. Justin Reed is a super good card, guys. Do not sleep on Justin Reed. This is going to be a banger. Free safety, regardless of what else you like. Hey, you, if you can get him, Terry, and you can get the new Deshaun Watson, you have a good team going. Now, this may be the final week of LTs. I'm not sure, unless they, re they start redoing it, because this was the final team that needed one. So I'm not sure if they're going to reset. You know, the teams are going to start going with LTDs in a different way or no more patterns. I'm really not sure. But moving on, guys, we have some playoff stuff as well. Scotty Miller gets a playoffs conference round card for obviously we had a big play. If you guys remember, there was no time before half and Tom Brady lofted it up and Scotty Miller scored right before half. Big touchdown, shifted momentum, gave him, you know, extended their lead. Great play by Scotty Miller. 93 speed, 84 jumping, 86 catching, 84 catching traffic. Oh, the cards kind of sucks. 84 spec, 86 short, 84 medium, and 86 deep route running. Cannot route run, cannot catch, and he's not the fastest card in the field, which kind of sucks. He's one of the fastest guys in the NFL, probably. But, I mean, overall, he's only an 89 overall. I guess if you chem him up, he could probably get his, play, you know, his, not even. He can, only get, he can only get shorter deep route running. You choose. I'm personally not a fan of the Scotty Miller card. But again, Kralo did mention that, you know, these are the worst cards they show, so there should be some better ones. Next, we got Raheem Mostert as one of the heroes. Now, this card's actually really good. 94 overall, Raheem Mostert. This is a throwback to last year. Um, conference championship, probably, with the 49ers. 95 speed, 94 excel, 93 agility, 92 carrying, 73 catching, 93 change of direction, 80 truck, 92 break tackle. Powder from Kemdub, 96 speed. We'll have good change of direction. Now, this is going to be a good card for one reason and one reason only. 96 speed may not be different from all the other running backs. Like, you know, uh, Alvin Kamara, you know, maybe Dalvin Cook. You know, it's right there in line, Bo Jackson. But the key here, the key is going to be that he's going to be in the master set. So if you can either probably get him, you can do the master set. And you know, the method I always do, sell the master and get Raheem Mostert as a, an NAT running back on your team for very cheap, which means you'll get a 96 speed running back for super cheap. Or just because he's a hero, it'll be cheap. So you're going to get a super budgety running back for good speed. And he may also also as well uh, lower the running back market, which could help. So I like the I like the introduction of Raheem Mostert. But guys, about it for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy if you're new to the channel. Subscribe. Turn on the noti bell. Give this video a big thumbs up. And if you guys need coins, pick up any of these bangers, which you probably will. Heading over to my reserve and use code POOL for an additional percentage off 
your total order. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. Enjoy the rest of your day. Peace.